Yes, today we are back with the next part of Times Square on the episode Choose Your Story Up. If you have not seen the other ones, catch up on the playlist around here somewhere. But we are being courted. Yes, we're not doing the whole dating thing. The dating thing, no. No. We're getting courted. That's like, This is a courtship. We are getting wild and crazy. Liam finally admitted his feelings. Which was so fun because it was kind of playfully going back and forth. It's the whole fake relationship that they had going on to the public and to the dad. Um, Aries knew, of course, her older brother. But now this has turned into a real deal situation. And they're on their way to their first date. Or what? Well, my bad. Their first courting experience. I don't know what you want to call it. But they're going to the beach. And it's real cute because there was some drama in the last chapter. Her father has to get deployed um, for something. It's. It's very like, I don't really know what's going on there, but it seems concerning. And I know I have my beef with him, but he's also a good father to her. And I don't want anything to happen to him. So I hope it's okay. And I hopefully he recovers and I'm hoping everything can recover soon. But so we're doing this little courting thing with Liam. We're going to the beach. He wants to take us there. But we literally end up with having to like climb the wall with all the barbed wire on it. And it's like... How are we getting over this? What are we doing here? What are we going to do about this? So let's see how this little experience goes. But please go follow and read the amazing author Janine's stories. You will love them. She's a brilliant writer. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving it a like as it helps the channel a lot. Subscribe if you haven't already. And without further ado, let's start the drama. We only live once, remember? Um, are we sure about this? You can do it, just make sure you don't touch the wires. Or else you'll make a scene. What happens if I touch the wires? Loud siren and you wake everybody. So first of all, we can't touch the wires. And if we do, we're going to get a loud siren and slice our entire body open. Oh my gosh, my brothers are going to kill me. Yeah, nope, I'm not going. You know, why don't we just sit right here against the wall? This is real cute. We got some privacy. The wall's behind us. It's wonderful. It's no, I want to spend time with you. I mean, ugh, whatever. Here, I'll give you a lift. She, she's got this. You got this, Ramona. Out. Uh. Did she do it? She did it. We're okay. We did it. Okay. Are you okay? You know, we're already, our faces are already bruised up. We are so tired. It's whatever. You didn't see anything. We're on the way to the beach, though. Well, I never thought Mr. Goody Two Shoes is actually two faced. Hey, so how long have you been doing this? What makes you think I've done this before? Oh, haha. Ha, please drop the innocent ad. We've, no, we've known you've done this, Liam. You knew how to get over this thing. This is my first time, right? I all, oh, it really is. I always see soldiers sneaking around, but I've never tried it before. I'm afraid to get caught, and I never had a reason to sneak around. So he's a little good boy, but he wanted to do something cute for us. Well, that's sweet. Look at him. So you're not afraid now. I still am, but now I have a reason to sneak around. Ooh, okay, okay. Don't blush, don't blush, don't blush. You're blushing. <laughs> She tried. We really, really tried. You know, we thought the bruises would cover things up, but now it came right through. This is real cute, though. Well, look at the moon. Oh, is that Sarky? Sarky and Second Lieutenant Shaw. I hope they get caught. <laughs> Want to ruin their nights? I don't think we can. My points are not. Yeah, for some reason, I don't have an appointed Liam. I don't know how I flopped with him so hard. Let's go somewhere else. Bummer, I really want to piss Starkey off. I need to get my points up with him, but I don't know what to say. Look at the sky. It's so bright and blue. Your favorite color. I don't remember telling you that. You didn't. But your teddy bear was a dead giveaway. He is observant. What's wrong? Nothing. You're going to have to say there's something very clearly wrong. That excuse never works. Oh, we're, okay. We're taking our hands together. Okay, okay. He's right behind us. You're worried about your dad, aren't you? Ramona, he's going to be okay. How are you so sure? 100%. Come on. He's the general. No one would dare touch him. I hope. I really hope. If you don't mind me asking, were you close with your dad too? I don't really know. Everything was vague because I was still young when he died. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have asked that. 
it's it's okay i don't mind let's change the topic why did you join the army good question i actually don't know i think because i wanted to be like my dad my mom told me he saved thousands of people back in 71 how did your parents meet my mom was a military nurse and i think you already know what happens next that's so cute a nurse and a soldier i was gonna say just like us but you're not a nurse She's a pharmacist, though. Come on, let's continue our journey. So why did you choose pharmacy? Because of their cute uniform. <laughs> seriously? Yes, seriously. What's your favorite color? Wait, don't tell me. Let me guess. Okay. Red, yellow, or black? I don't know, y'all. I don't know. Oh my gosh, I'm stressed. Red? Correct. I guess red is my favorite color now. Uh, he lied. He totally just said sure. Liam? Boo. Oh, she was decked him though. That's okay, they're having a cute experience. I was going to say blue because of a shirt, but we already did blue. Well, this is a cute little date. They're just having a good old time. But I wonder who built the gazebo here. Is that a guitar? A soldier probably left this. Do you know how to play? No, how about you? What song do you want me to play? Oh, she knows how to play guitar. Surprise me. What the world needs now is love, sweet love. It's the only thing that there's just too little of. What the world needs now... Okay, so they're really having an evening. Come on, it'll be fun. I'm scared. And he told me we're not going for a swim. Conquer your fear. Fine. Oh! Oh, he's he has so many trunks on. I thought we were going to go commando. <laughs> what are you waiting for? You got this, Ramona. You owe me gray. Oh, I bet he's going to be smitten. Nice tattoo, what does it mean? It means I had an extra $300 at some point in my life. <laughs> okay, she's got this. Okay, here is better. I don't want to go further. Okay. What's gonna happen? She looks uncomfortable, poor thing. But he got a smile on his face. What's he about to do? Will you stop humming the Jaws theme song? <laughs> I hate you. Already, we still haven't got the chance to like each other, and you already hate me. You know what? I already like you. Oh, please. I already like you. Aw. Exclamation price. You love seeing me do cringe stuff. I, yes, I do. We love being honest out here. Good to know I like you, too. What's happening now? What's that? What's what? Something touched my feet. You just gonna go under and look? It's just seaweed. Oh, you don't go out much, do you? No. Why do you ask? You're pretty much scared of everything. Okay, but well, you know what? We got in the water. We did our best. We had a little crap at 32 a.m. Really? I guess no sleep for me. I have to get up at five. If it makes you feel better, I have to get up at six. Okay, well, the little courting experience was really cute. I'm very happy with that. That was adorable. Wait a minute. <gasps> okay, no. When I saw when I saw the bed right there, I was like, did she spend the night with him? <gasps> But no, they um they just got back in the middle. That was the longest walk I did in my entire life. I think I should go. I think you should stay. Oh, oh, plus the most three they're doing rounds during that hour. Crap. So you might want to turn around. I'm gonna change my undies. Okay, we're gonna be respectful. And peek. Don't peek, don't peek. You're a decent woman, Ramona. Or am I? Stop it. Um, Liam, you can turn around now. Okay, look at his little chest hair, too. Oh, I love Liam. Mm, my undies are wet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Want to borrow my brief? Do I have a choice? You can borrow my shirt, too, if you want. 
Okay, well, we're, we're actually going to spend the night with him. I mean, it's innocent. It's innocent. Cute. Don't be, don't be. You're not Sarky. I'm done. You're not Sarky. Crap. Don't look at... <laughs> Do you want a thicker shirt? I have one. No, I think I'm good. You're killing me here, Estrada. Oh, we're gonna... So we only have a few hours. Should we still go to sleep? I don't know about you, but I'm not even sleepy. Yeah, same here. All right, they're gonna stay up all night and have a cute little talk, I bet. You're not sleepy, huh? Oh, he fell asleep with her. That's so cute. What's going on? Liam, wake up. Is it already time to wake up? Liam, someone's at the door. <gasps> Uh-oh. Lieutenant Gray, Captain Davis. Crap! Liam, get up, someone's at the door! Lieutenant Gray, hide! Where? I don't know under the bed! Lieutenant Gray. This is ridiculous. Oh, this is so awkward. Hello! We are totally in here by ourselves. I am so sorry about this. Captain Davis! We got a call from General Estrada. Daddy. <gasps> What did he say? Miss Estrada? Is he okay? I'm not allowed to. Captain, just tell her. They requested for backup. Nothing serious, though. Do I look stupid to you? He wouldn't request her backup if it's not serious. Ramona, calm down. They can't declare war while the general's there. Anyway, Estrada requested for the best sniper we have. So you're looking for Second Lieutenant Watson. He's not in his room. He's probably at Second Lieutenant Shaw's room. <laughs> everyone's in everyone's room right now. Okay, that'll be all, Lieutenant Gray. Miss Estrada. The fact we just got up under the bed. I told you to hide. Sorry. Will you get demoted because of that? No, we're lucky it was Captain Davis. He's my friend. I better get back to my building. Sorry I fell asleep. Oh, she really put him at risk. Oh my gosh. Okay, but now we're back to training. We have no sleep because we were up all night. Uh-huh. Alice, I don't feel so. Um. Private Estrada. We straight up fainted. <laughs> we straight up fainted. But the courtship was cute, though. Let's talk about the courtship real quick. Okay, so. We went and had a little date courtship, whatever they're calling it in this. But it was real cute. It was real nice. We had a real good time. I was proud of Ramona. She was very brave. She got in the water. She doesn't like swimming. She has a fear of it. So I was very proud of her for that. They're cute. They're good together. They're real good together. I like where this is going. And Liam was such a sweetheart. The thing about Liam is he is such an amazing man. He is so sweet. He has people's best interests at heart. He's just a great guy. Like, there's nothing negative about him. I mean, I'm sure there's negative qualities. Everybody has negative qualities. But in terms of, like, just being a good person, there's nothing bad about him. He's just a real sweetheart. He's a good guy. And I think he'll be really good for Ramona. And I think he'll kind of help her break out of her shell a little bit. And just open up more and enjoy life and see the world. But we're going to see what happens here. I'm a little worried about the dad because he's now requesting the backup, which is not good. I know it was just a precaution or something, but eek. Very big eek. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And I hope to see you all on the next one. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, bye everyone.